So in 1980, when I began working on Blade Runner, Ridley Scott, like, well, he asked me out to dinner one time, and then he asked me out again, and then, and then he kind of got a little more aggressive, and then I basically realized that he wanted to date me. And I was like, no, I'm not dating you. And, uh, and that seemed, at the time, like it was, it was fine. He was like, okay. And he started dating Joanna Cassidy, and that was fine with me. And then this was when he was married to his first wife. And um, I didn't realize, we'll say that first, that's えっと、ジョアナ・キャシディさんと彼はえっと、デートするようになっていたようで、でもその時はミドリスコットカンドは彼のあの、最初の奥さんとまだ結婚していた最中だったということです。There <笑> so, I thought at the time Everything was fine between Ridley and I because we worked together. We had a good time. I felt like I was doing my job. I felt like he was doing his job. But then, after the movie ended, Ridley, for the next, you know, 35 years or 38 years, never hired me again. And I would call his office and I'd say, you know, could I be considered for this role or that role? And I never was, ever again. And when the sequel came up, I sort of thought, how can he not hire me for this? あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あ
するようにということだったのかあの、えー、と一切あのノンディスクロージャーのアグリーメントといって契約を結ばされてあの詳細について全くこの映画とかについて口外しないという契約を結ばされました、えー、とただ彼女の存在を全く入れないで、えー、と続編を作るということはやっぱり不可能だったんだと思っています So he really basically left me on the curb in terms of the sequel. Not technically, but really, I should have been in the movie. And、um, it was then that, like, for, for 35 years, I never said a bad word about Ridley ever. But it was then I realized that he had held a grudge all that time. That, that was my conclusion. 本来とすれば、まあ、続編なので自分が参加するはずの映画だったんだけれどもあの自分がその、えー、と仮面を出演という形でしか参加できなかったということを知った時に初めてあのスコット監督がもう長い期間にわたって自分に対してこう恨みと言いますか,なんか嫌な気持ちを持っているんだなということを本当にあの深く感じました。